Hey everyone, it's Paul from Legacy Lumber, and in this video we're going to go from rough lumber to shiplap siding through this 5 head molding machine. We're in the process of creating 10,000 square feet of shiplap sosuji bond siding. If you don't know what that is, that's an ancient Japanese technique of burning wood and then brushing it to achieve certain textures as well as colors. It also increases the rot resistance and pest resistance of the wood. So check it out, that was about an hour of running the Sosuji Bond siding through our milling machine. We can do about a thousand square feet during that hour, which is pretty awesome. We actually used to spend more time doing the dust collection, but we remedied that, and uh, we're able just to pump through the uh, siding now. It does make a lot of dust, of course, but this machine is awesome. Rough lumber in, full shiplap siding coming out the other end. We're loving the Procomat 26 Super. Look at the beautiful grains. Well, that's it. We just wrapped up 10 and a half thousand square feet of shiplap siding. We then burned it through our burning monster and uh, produced a Sosuji Bond siding. All thanks to this uh, beautiful machine, a Procomat 26 Super from Winning. Let's crack it open. I'll show you what's on the inside. So if you don't already know, what this machine does, it can take rough lumber in, on the one side, it will pass through this machine, and it has five different cutting heads, which then add a profile to all of the faces by the time it comes through the other end of the machine. Pretty awesome. Why is that five heads instead of four? Because obviously a piece of wood has four sides. The very first head is used to square up the lumber. So it'll hit the bottom side as well as the edge to give us a nice 90 degree angle, then the rest of the heads can do their job. Uh, we have two side heads powered by a single motor and what these are, it's a high speed steel blade. These are interchangeable. So we can do a tongue and groove, we can do different shiplap patterns, uh, we can do all sorts of profiles on the edges. Then we move to a top head. This top head is a spiral carbide insert uh, um, head which leaves an exceptional finish. It's also quiet which is really nice. We then move to a, another bottom head, because the first bottom head's just for squaring up the wood. The last bottom head will do your final thickness, as well as uh, for flooring or siding, you have a little bit of stress relief groove in there, um, or any other thing you'd like to add to the back side of the wood. So it's a pretty amazing machine. We love having it. Again, if you don't already know, I get a lot of machines through online classifieds and auctions. So uh, we did, uh, get this used machine, so it's, it is new to us, but it's definitely not new. This is a 2005, but you know what? I bought it for probably a tenth of what it would cost brand new. It cost us a few thousand dollars in some maintenance issues that it had, and um, we just pounded through 10 and a half thousand square feet of shiplap siding through this machine flawlessly. So super excited to have this, looking forward to the future and uh, running a lot more wood through this machine. Thanks as always for watching this video. This is the outro, I think. Hey, <laughs> if not, Sebastian will make it the outro. So thanks again for watching this video. Smash that like button if you've liked it. If you would like an even more in-depth video on this machine, let us know uh, in the comments below. And even if you have any other questions, let us know. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel to stay updated. As always, thanks for watching. Have a great day.